Hi there. What we're going to do today is I have three Ernie Ball Music Man guitars. These are all made in San Luis Obispo, USA made, and they all have their own characteristics. So we're going to play them back to back to back, uh, amp settings all the same, so you can hear those subtle differences between each guitar. This one here, this is an Axis Sport. It's a one-piece ash body, bolt-on model, maple and rosewood. Passive pickups, open coil. This is a 2016 Stingray. So this is a newer model. You know, some people think the older guitars sound different than the newer ones. Uh, that is true. So there's little nuances that you hear in older and newer guitars, different models. So we'll see what this one sounds like. And uh, these pickups are covered, so that's a very subtle difference too in the pickups. Pick guard, mahogany body, maple neck. Rosewood fretboard. And lastly, but not least, this is a BFR model. This is a Ball Family Reserve Luke, the original Luke. Currently, they're making one, a model called the Luke 3. This is the Luke 1. This has a really nice flame maple top. Probably hard to see that without the light. This is called Ruby Burst, but it's a really, really deep red. The body is alder, and really interesting is this neck. That is solid rosewood. So it's a rosewood shaft all the way through. Absolutely beautiful neck. So there is definitely a price difference between these. The BFR is really the most expensive guitar. This runs about $2,800 new. So it should sound good. We hope so at that price point. Um, so let's go ahead and shoot them out. I'm going to play them with gain, and then I'm going to play them with clean. We'll start with the same right.
the gain now, but let's do it a little higher volume. Give you a little more power this time, as this is a fairly... to compare those. 
So this guitar definitely has a lot of its own things going on. And this one probably sounded to me the biggest, the Stingray. It's got a really big body and all mahogany, you know, a mahogany slab. So that one had a lot of projection, not from the electronics, but the actual wood tone. Really big sound stage on this one. So I don't know if you hear or heard any of that, but that's what my ears tell me about these different guitars. So hopefully you had fun with this. Uh, Ernie Ball makes great guitars. I really enjoy these. Kind of slightly under the radar brand compared to like Gibson and Fender. So these are really great guitars worth checking out. So hopefully you enjoyed this video. If you do, we make little short clips like this on some of the interesting guitars that I come across. So feel free to subscribe and uh, check out our demos. Thanks.